stupid thing that's benefited out of my little brother taking to the hospital. Today, I'm going to recycle all the oil containers that we've had sitting up in the garage here at the recycling that Dow Chemical is doing because uh, they've been sitting in the garage in plastic containers forever and I want to take them out and um, have all these wonderful people recycle. They, they don't only do oil and coolant, household products, paint, you name it. And it, it's really cool that I'm doing this. So I'm going to stop the car or truck, open the tailgate up, and they're going to empty out all this stuff for me. Having fun? You let him do that to you, Ralph? I can get y'all a motel. <laughs> now, after working up a powerful appetite after taking all that oil and all those things, by the way, this is the next day. That was Saturday, yesterday. And I worked up a powerful appetite. With that in mind, it's time to make a barbecue. And it's so nice outside. With all the speeding vehicles zooming up and down, up and down, in and out, in and out in the street, I figure I could just break away and just make a little barbecue. With that, I found the lowest sodium. Come on, focus in, you piece of crap. Eh. Yeah. The lowest sodium of 115 milligrams sodium barbecue sauce I'm just putting an itty bitty bit two tablespoons it says you get that much I'm just gonna put in one into this mixture with brown sugar a little bit of butter again low, no sodium no salt butter bee spit aka honey lemons lemon juice and baste it on top of dun 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 dun, dun wings and drumsticks only a couple Add to that spinach, low, which is low sodium, frozen spinach, and maybe just to bend the rules a little bit, just a little child's plate portion of potato salad. And there you have it. Yum yum. For now. I already had, may not look like it, but I already ate batch number one. <laughs> we got the bushes of baked beans. My little brother's and potato salad ready made. Little brother's chowing out, and here's the finished product. Woo! -woo. Wings and legs. And that was batch number one. We donate almost half of it, almost all of it. Ha! <laughs> and here is, along with a couple ears of corn on the cob, batch number two just sizzling away. Woo! -woo. Yum, yum. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Till next time on this clear day. Clear eyes. There's more kitten fun to wrap this video up, I hope. Are they still in there or is she moving them on their sleeve? Look at that. The kitten in the flower pot bunch. And look, look what she's done trying to crawl in and out of there. Call marks. Oh, they're all asleep. They're about two weeks old, I think. <laughs> she has moved them all over the place. But as long as it doesn't rain on it, I get I guess they're okay. Let's see if we can go find more kitty fun. There's more kittens back there. And there's a antsy skitsy mom back there and she runs off. Leaving three babies. <laughs> One of them with a totally pale face like his dad, her dad. That's a girl. I'll turn it down. I'm tired of our street being so noisy. Let's see if there are any more kittens.
There's Lindy and Tux in the almighty barbecue pit. And there's Dolly. Dolly will let you, well, sometimes she'll run off. And there's the cat in the ditch, Peachy. Peachy King. Now come on, Peachy, get out of that disgusting ditch. It's all dried up. And that's it, pretty much. Enjoyed the barbecue today. And I'll come back with the till next time. Uh, so noisy down this street. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, yeah, the biggest problem is we live too close to this damn street. See, a long time ago, this was nothing but a rut road. Two little ruts going here. And then it turns into a noise filled street with them adding more and more houses <sighs> because it used to be cane fields around here well it still is but way further back I don't know time to retire <laughs> away from here till next time again blue sky no till next video clip or whatever comes first I don't know